Okay, as promised, um, I'm going to go through the assignments and projects that you will have this semester. So I will be going through this page and um, to the assignments um, description that are in Moodle. So if you remember from the welcome video, you will find syllabus and assignments here. I have accessed these assignments under the activities tab here. So you see I put the lab uh, manual. This you will um, have before your lab class. This is what you'll need to engage with the activities during class. You will have two competencies in your first lab, <clears throat> one on hand hygiene and one on how to don and doff. Um, protective personal equipment. This is a pass or no pass, so there is no rubric attached to it. You just have to demonstrate that you're able to do it. There's also no rubric. This is basically a pass, no pass. It's an easy 100. Um, it is creating a, your interpretation, a visual representation of the ODPF4. Don't get worried about it. We'll talk about it in class. Lab manual, 24 hour check. This is another easy 100. This is, um, there's no rubric attached to it. There are instructions in Moodle um, related to what to expect um, for this very small assignment. Lab manual number three, cultural competence assignment. That is your first larger assignment. So each of your assignments will have details and then the grading rubric. So here is what the assignment should look like and here are my expect our expectations for um, grading so when you do your assignments be sure to read the grading rubric because that is how we award points um, for thoroughness and clarity and you read it and you'll understand a code standards this is our credentialing agency um, this is the objectives that we have laid out for you to meet based on this assessment, based on this assignment. So if you're interested in reading these ACODE standards um, and what you, the intent of you getting out of this um, assignment, they're listed at the bottom of each of your assignments. Walkability assignment. Now I have mine pulled up in my Google Docs. Um, you um, you have access of um, you have access to them in Moodle, but feel free to upload them to Google Docs as well. So you'll see everything looks very similar. The details of this assignment, and then what the criteria is for grading, what we expect to see, and then your A code standards. So I um, won't go through all of them. You know, you can see I've got them all pulled up, so I'm not going to go back and forth. Um, but as the assignments get closer, you'll see I'm very clear about when they're due. We can talk more about what the expectations and what these assignments will look like. Um, the intent is each week there's a, the weekly topic and the assignment directly builds on your readings and your developing knowledge of that topic area. So that those are your assignments. You do have one group project and that is closer towards the end of the semester and that is your Shark Tank Equipment Design Project. So for this assignment you will be um, assigned into a team. This is group work and I feel most of you are going Ugh, I hate group work, but we're, we, that's what we do. We work as a team, we work as a group, and we have to work together. So within this assignment, you will create, design, and um, build a piece of equipment that could benefit a person, a group, or a population. You'll work together, you will design it, you will create it, you will videotape yourself, giving some sort of presentation about um, your piece of equipment. So as we get closer to it, you will go over it a little bit more in detail. 
um, you will be assigned your group earlier enough in the semester that you can get a head start on this project so that you're not leaving it to the last possible second. And then we will meet with you, each group, to kind of process and go over what you're working on to make sure that um, the project is moving smoothly. So I hope that was helpful to go over some of those assignments um, and make sure you look at your syllabus because that is where you will find when the due dates are um, and all of the pertinent information that you need to know.